Hey everyone, it's Phil Page, Director of Research at Performance Health. I'm here with Todd Ellenbecker, who's been one of our research advisory members since the first one, right? Yes, New Orleans. Absolutely, New Orleans. 1998. Not long ago. Yeah, it was a long time. It was in New Orleans. Yeah. And uh, I, Todd was one of the first clinicians that really jumped on board with what we're trying to do with research. Um, and he's been a tremendous clinical researcher for such a long time. Uh, really happy to have him around for our, for this long to do all the things that you've done. So, just wanted to get an idea. Uh, you, you've been doing research every year uh, on the team, and just if you could tell us a little bit about what your most recent studies that you're working on now that has to do with TheraBand kinesiology tape. Tell us a little bit about exactly. it. Exactly. So, with the kinesiology tape, the TheraBand kinesiology tape, we wanted to try to establish. Uh, some idea or establish the theory of why it works. We know that it works. We know that putting kinesiology tape on somebody uh, will help their function. However, what we don't know is the mechanism why. Right. And so what we're doing is we're taking the TheraBand kinesiology tape and we're putting it on in uh, four different strips. Three coming up from inferior here up over the top, anchoring just at the AC joint, yep. both middle, anterior, and posterior, and then a strip pulling the scapula back. So we're doing that in a randomized fashion, and what we're trying to show, or trying to determine, is we're looking at isometric strength and internal and external rotation strength. And we're trying to see in both normals and people who have symptoms, whether the TheraBand kinesiology tape decreases their symptoms and or, so we have a VAS pain rating scale, as well as do they have more strength? Because the question we have as clinicians is, that, and some people, if we put TheraBand kinesiology tape, does it make them stronger? Does it give them that support? Does it give them greater dynamic stability for their shoulder? If it does, we know we're doing a good thing. Right. And we may it may help us to understand a little bit why that type of tape works. Right. Uh, one of the reasons we like using this particular tape is we're using a 25% elongation factor. And the TheraBand kinesiology tape has the hexagons that allow us to be sure that when I'm applying it, even though I've done it for years, it's a great way for me to check to be sure that my technique, I'm the only one taping the subjects each time that I'm doing it with 25% elongation. That's awesome. yeah, so that's great. It's a, oh, we're glad that you're uh, you know, contributing to how much we know about kinesis because we really don't know the mechanism behind it and a lot of the stuff that you do is going to help us to learn more about how it works. And I think if we can determine what patients are maybe optimal candidates for yeah, it, because exactly. some of the things as a clinician is you don't want to yeah. necessarily tape everybody. You want to know if there's some patients that maybe are you know, you get a greater benefit. Maybe that's impingement right. patients respond better than instability or vice versa. Wow. And maybe it has an effect in normals. And that's why we're testing both normals and people with shoulder dysfunction so that we can see if there's a different that's effect great. among the two. That so. is fantastic. Well, thank you for doing that. So tell us um, a little bit about why you, what do you, why is track important to you? What do you love about it? What do you think it gives back to you and to the profession? You know, what are the, what's the value of track to you? Well, there's a lot of things. Number one, obviously, just because we're on contest, because we're on camera, but working with you, Phil, has been great, and Thank I appreciate you. the support through all the years. But uh, as you and I both enjoy this, the international effect of track. Yeah. I mean, to be able to sit there with researchers from Europe, from Asia, from virtually all over the world, and be able to understand uh, what research they're doing, how they're using the appliances. Um, for example, the bands and the tubing. You know, I've learned all sorts of techniques because of you and the others about different ways to apply the bands and the tubing that I would have never thought of. Using it in multiple vectors, using in multiple planes, um, just to be able to share that and get to know people from year to year and have them come in and present their research. Uh, the collegial relationships that we've shared has, has been yeah. immensely meaningful to both me and, and my wife Gail yeah. as well, yeah. being able to, to be part of it and, and, right. and, and, and as you allow. So That's great. Well, thank Good. you so much. For All right, Phil. Thank buddy. you. Good. Thank you so much.